Boom. Boom. Oh. Where do we get these, Aaron? Walmart. How much were they? I don't know. I think they were 10 bucks. 10 bucks. 10 bucks. The $10 Barbie Rod Challenge. We've accepted. We're going to try it today. We're also going to check some stuff off of our bucket list. What number is this one? So we're actually checking off two today. The first one is number 61, win a one versus one fish off, which I guess only one of us is going to be able to check that off today. Yeah, I'll let you win. Oh, that's sweet of you, but I think I'm going to win it. I'll let her win. <laughs> okay, continue. Where we, what oh, number is I don't it? know if I even want to play. The next one that we're going to be crossing off is number 70, catch a fish using a kid's fishing rod. Okay. Let's go. All right, let's hit these up. I call the Barbie rod. So now, before we start the competition, I'd like to just kind of check out the depths over here. I want to see if there's any holes and stuff like that. So we're going to throw the deeper right now. So I've been using this for a couple years now. And this technology is very helpful for me because I'm able to chart out all the depths and keep it on my database. It's called Lakebook. In Lakebook, I keep going back to it and referring to all the depths finding the holes in certain spots. So when I go to a new spot, I always measure out the depth with the deeper, and then it goes into my database on Lakebook. And today, I'm gonna to be casting this and looking for deep holes, deep pockets, because I know that's where the fish are gonna be hiding. Uh, this will save me a lot of time. This will kind of give me more insight as to what I'm fishing. I think this tool is a great tool for anglers because it really helps you smarten up. You get to know the depths, you get to research, you get to remember what was good, what was bad. It takes a lot of the guesswork out of it because you can really see what's under there. You can see what fish are under there as well. It's a very valuable tool. Let's get going. You ready? Okay, I'm starting way out there first. 16, 17 feet. Whoa, Whoa. I did not know that. It's getting shallow, right? Nope, that's deep right there. That's a little pocket right there. 14, 13, 12, 11, getting shallower. <laughs> All right, this line is super thin. This is gonna be fun. This is gonna be fun. Made in China. There's only two eyes. All right, I'm just gonna tie it right on here. I teach how to do this knot in our in our ebook. It's pretty simple. Loop knot. I'm gonna put a little bead on here. Don't copy my idea, Aaron. I was gonna do a high low rig anyway. Oh my gosh! So, so. you're so basically you're copying my idea. Almost done. Boom! There's my rig. Looking very cute. That's Eat how you cute. make a rig really quick. It's this knot, and then a sinker, and on this knot you just slide the hook on, and you slide a bead on, and I'm gonna use, I think we use a tentacle this time. One of these, from our Squiddy Bits bait. I can catch lots of fish on one little piece like this. Aaron, your turn to set up yours. All right. Okay. Here you go, Aaron. Wait, I'm so. Does this look good for you? What are you doing? Is this even real? Yes. Real is good. Go ahead. Oh. It was upside down. <laughs> oh my god. So oh my gosh. Okay. All right. So can I can I pick can I pick uh, some tackle for you? No. Why? Because I want to pick it myself. I already picked some. No, that's way too big. What? I know that's too big. This boy. Is better? How about this one? What? There's nothing wrong with this one, it's a barbed one. I don't know, I feel like you're trying to trick me. Do you want this hook or not? No. What I'm hook do you want? I'm going to pick it myself. Oh snap, oh snap, it worked. My hair oh. is getting caught in it. She tied it. Don't break it. Shake it, don't break it. Shake it, don't break Shake it. Shake it, don't break it. <laughs> oh, here it is. My one ounce sinker. My little loopy loop. Let's. I'm kind of high off the 
bottom. That is really high off the bottom. Whatever. It might it might work out. Let's try it. Maybe I'll get more scuffed than sea robin doing that. Alright, Barbie Rod. This is the princess edition. Okay, that was easy to cast. This feels funny. I like the power knob on here. Look at that power knob. It's gonna give me some good action. It's gonna give me some good action. <laughs> How'd that happen? It did a backflip off your hand. I was like, I, I let go of the thing and I just let go of my whole thing. Wow. Look, I got a fish. Wait, you did? Yeah. Look, I got a fish. Oh, it's pulling. Look at this fish. I got a zero of it. The freaking princess run. I got one. Oh, oh, oh. All right, so after we completed the bucket list challenge, uh, which is to catch a fish on a kid's rod. Um, if you complete a challenge, take a picture, tag us on Instagram, and we'll feature you. All right, let them go. All right, so you won the catch, catch a fish with a kid's rod challenge so yep. far, but we're still working on that we're one We're still working one. on that 1v1. We'll, we'll set this for one hour, okay? We have one hour to compete. Okay. Who can catch the most fish in one hour? Okay, you're one ahead of me. Oh, oh, this count? What? I got a crab. That does. It does. No, it's not a fish. The crab's not a fish. Um, no, that's good bait, though. Ready? Full arm swing. Ha! Ah! Nice cast, Brendan. That was a good one. Oh, I got a bite. You have one? No, I missed. No, it's on now. Oh, oh no, it's God. off. Come on, Eric. Oh, God. I do have to say that we did. You on? Yeah. Shoot! Oh, I'm on, I'm on, I'm on! Oh my god! I'm on you! No! We're both Watch on! Watch us be on each other! No, we're not, we're not! I'm on a fish! Oh, it's pulling my drag! I'm a point to the porgy! No! Oh! <laughs> we're doubled up, we're doubled up! Oh, it's my drag! It's pulling my drag! Oh, is that a sea moment? No! No, you got some the Oh, there's a porgy, there's a porgy. Oh, I got a big porgy too! Woo! Look at that! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! <laughs> Two to one. So I just completed my bucket list. Alright, you got your bucket list now. These guys are gorgeous. The blue and gray. Again. They got gnarly teeth. I think I'm gonna throw this one back. Do you think we should eat this one? No, throw it back. It's fall. Yay! On! You're on? Yeah, you see me do that? Yeah. Oh man, it's stealing my jack. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's stealing it. I hope I don't lose it again. I sit that pretty hard. I see a line moving left and right. There he is. There he is, coming in. What is it? It's a corgi. Nice. Nice. Okay, Same piece of squid, over and over and over again. You don't need to change it out. That's the beauty of the squiddy bits.
such a fun ride. It's a nice porgy. Ha! No, oh, nice. Wait, it got your hook? Yeah, it took me just snapped right now. Oh my god, almost got, don't put your finger in his mouth. I forgot. Nice one, Aaron. Yay! Two to four. Oh my god. Oh it snapped! Yeah, you're snapped snap too. <laughs> we both snapped off. Darn it. Okay, so it's been an hour. I can admit defeat when I'm defeated. You told me not to let you win. That's fine. I'm glad you didn't. <laughs> I tried to, and it's, you still lost. You so. creamed me. You creamed me. You got it's, four. It's because you couldn't two. cast it out. Yeah, it was, I, I had a lot of trouble casting it. Like, I don't know. Maybe it's because you've like messed around with like funny rods before, or maybe know. it's just because I'm not good at this. <laughs> that's how you that's how you upset Aaron if you say stuff like that. <laughs> you you crushed me, so well, congratulations. Good, good, good sport. Maybe next time you can Maybe learn how to cast time. that a little better. Yeah. That was really the limitation is yeah. this is very hard to cast. A far, far distance, I think. You know, it's not like meant for But I have so much practice casting the dock demon. Yeah, that's it. And so much practice casting the M rod yeah. that I'm pretty much an expert at casting little tiny things. We're gonna cook them up now, right? Oh yeah, now we're gonna cook them up right here. Let's do it. Mm. See what I mean by it's very soft? It's very flaky meat, yeah. I think it's done. All right, I'm gonna get you a piece, okay? Tell me how you like it. Really good? Mm -hmm. no? Very good. Stuff is good. Very good. Stuff is good. Very good. Yeah. So flaky. It's so really flaky. flaky. It's fattier than the, the sea robin that we did. Yeah. Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. Alright, so thank you guys for joining us. Um, hey. You guys should download our free PDF, our bucket list. This is a bucket list that we've all compiled together. Right. You guys submitted the bucket list stuff. We just put it in order and we're doing all the challenges that you guys have offered us. If you want to download and follow along, that would be great. Right. And similarly, at that same link where you can download your ultimate fishing bucket list, you can check out the Squiddy Bits, which is what we use today to catch all these porgy. We use one piece. I use one piece the all day. The whole time. I mean, I like, yeah, like we caught many, many fish on, on each one, one piece. piece. So we have a lot more bait. Check it out. Link in the description below. Thank you guys for joining us. Give us a thumbs up if you like this episode. And uh, see ya. See